Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Sobat Gadget Digital Smart Hari ini kita akan share ya akan berbagi uh, Tentang Huawei Mate 30 Pro Today I want to share uh, about Mate 30 Pro uh, Saya akan berbagi cara menambah account Google I want to share how to add another a Google account when in, uh, your phone already freeze for the notification. Jadi saya akan berbagi gimana caranya untuk uh, menambahkan email ketika kita sudah ngefreeze notifikasi pop up yang sudah kita lakukan di Mate 30 Pro sebelumnya. Uh, so I want to to let you know uh, how to add another mail ya yeah, another gmail to Huawei Mate 34 that was already uh, freeze for a pop up oke okay. ini adalah Huawei Mate 30 Pro dan ini sudah kita freeze this is a Mate 30 Pro this phone already freeze for pop up notification if we open If we open, uh, notification already gone. Notifikasinya udah nggak ada. For the first time, untuk pertama kali kita harus mendownload dulu. So we have to download uh, an application Icebox. Ya, kita harus mendownload aplikasi yang namanya Icebox. Uh, agak sedikit ribet ya, karena membutuhkan sebuah laptop. This is uh, more complicated because we need PC or laptop to do ADB shell ya untuk mengirim perintah ADB shell untuk uh, icebox ini agar bisa bekerja. Oke. Okay. Setelah kita download icebox, icebox sudah di download. Kita sekarang ke setting about. Klik 7 kali build number. You push seven times the build number until you are now developer. Pop up ya, sampai keluar your developer back. Lalu kita ke sistem update. There is developer option uh, in here. Okay, USB debugging on. Okay di here finish sampai sini selesai ya nah setelah selesai lalu kita menuju ke laptop so we are go to PC or laptop let's see this Nah, uh, kita harus menginstal. We have to install the minimal ADB and the fast boot. You can search around the world, ya, yeah? around the Google. Kamu bisa cari di Google. Just uh, type minimal ADB, minimal ADB and fast boot. Jadi cari aja di Google itu minimal ADB dan fast boot. Nah nanti kalau udah ketemu ya tinggal kita panggil aja ini aplikasinya nanti keluar seperti ini. Nah setelah keluar seperti ini ya ada perintah yang harus kita eksekusi. Perintah itu adalah perintah ini nanti akan saya tulis di deskripsi. Uh, the command line will be written in the description so you can execute uh, just copy and paste ya yeah. oke okay. so uh, the next we put uh, here wait we put uh, the USB type C to the meter tipe ya oke okay. nah 
if you uh, never installed uh, the high shoot you can install it now ya jadi kalau kamu belum menginstal high shoot ya silahkan di install aja gak apa-apa nah, ini saya udah ke install nah after that setelah itu just close this nah di sini ketikin aja a d fit kita delete dulu ya let clear it first clear a d b ya space d by sis sis DB devices and enter. Let's see your phone. Oh, wait. Just close this. Okay. There's no no pop up on your phone because the ADB USB debugging is off just turn it on oke okay. nah you your uh, mid 30 pro will pop up allow USB debugging just checklist ya yeah. nanti akan keluar kayak gini checklist aja and klik oke okay. and you are dan to here Let's click ok Let's click ok and you type here adb devices and enter if you find like this the device mean connected kalau kamu ketemu kayak gini you have devices device it mean that your phone is already connected jadi handphone kalian sudah terkoneksi and then what next next we execute ya yeah, uh, we execute the command line the command line I will show you I take this on my youtube channel just put it here Nah, you will execute this command I will write the description uh, I will write the command in the description Dia akan saya tulis di deskripsi ya Oke okay. Saya pindah ini And push enter in your computer Then the ice box will pop up in the computer you can see success this one ya yeah, success oke okay, pop up will appear in your phone so just let the USB connector never uh, disconnect ya yeah. jangan lepasin tetapin aja uh, USB nya connect oke okay, next next simple adb pilih simple adb apps got it go to system checklist this got it wait okay system and then search frame work see google framework ya see google framework you highlight ya kita highlight google framework and then freeze dan selesai close go to setting go to user and account add an account Google account and existing. If you see this, 
it mean that you success okay just enter the email and the password as many as you can if you have two three four five just put it kalau kalian punya lebih dari satu email masukinlah sekarang karena nanti kalian akan ribet lagi harus uh, menggunakan komputer oke okay. i will add one mail ya yeah. one email and i will try to delete an old mail oke okay. I'm already put my email then click next just click ok oh. if you find like this yeah if you find like this never give up ya yeah, kalau kalian ketemu kayak gini jangan nyerah nih if you find like this never give up so what you want uh, so what you want to do next ya yeah. ini ya yang harus kita lakukan selanjutnya adalah go to google account ya google account manager just push the storage and then clear data ya oke okay. close all tutup semua setelah di clear data setting lagi go to setting again user and account ya go to setting and user and account and account go to google just click ok existing and enter again your uh, username and password masukin lagi username dan passwordnya ya ok If still, okay. If still like this, again, uh, you may uninstall it first and install another version, uh, the version four zero three. Yeah, install ulang yang versi empat kosong tiga dan Uh, lagi again go to user and account add account google account next existing oke okay. it should be success let's see again sign in successful next now we have to email why it cannot sync because the framework already freeze kenapa nggak mau sync karena frameworknya kita freeze tadi nah setelah selesai kita bisa remove email yang ini kalau mau dibuang if you want to remove just 
one mil if you want to replace kalau kalian mau mengganti so next go to icebox again apps system and start a framework this one this one and then push defrost lalu lakukan defrost selesai oke okay, sudah selesai finish and then restart your bone and you are finished oke okay, thank you for watching assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh